Unit 8, Interests and Free Time. Dialogue 1. What are some of your personal interests outside of work? Well, I really enjoy gardening. Uh, it helps me relax. I also enjoy learning foreign languages. What foreign languages have you studied? Uh, currently, I'm studying Chinese and Japanese. In the past, I've studied German as well. Dialogue 2. Can you tell me about some of your hobbies or personal interests? Well, I'm usually very busy taking care of my children and doing housework. But when I do have free time, I like to read and listen to music. Dialogue 3 Please tell me about your interests outside of work. I love learning about computers. Sometimes I do programming work for my friends when I have free time. What do you do to relax or to have fun? I like listening to music and I enjoy playing basketball. Dialogue 4 What are some things that you do in your free time? I love cooking. I've taken several classes on cooking. I also like to play tennis. Whenever I can, I play tennis with my friends. Dialogue 5 What are some of your hobbies or personal interests? Uh, I enjoy reading and playing the guitar. I also enjoy surfing the internet and swimming. What do you do to relax or to have fun? I like listening to music and I enjoy playing basketball. What are some of your personal interests outside of work? Well, I really enjoy gardening. Uh, it helps me relax. I also enjoy learning foreign languages. Can you tell me about some of your hobbies or personal interests? Well, I'm usually very busy taking care of my children and doing housework. But when I do have free time, I like to read and listen to music. Unit 9 Reasons for leaving a previous job. Dialogue 1. Why did you leave your previous job? My company was downsizing because of the economy, so I was laid off. Other people had been there for over 10 years, and I had only been there for two. So I was laid off first. Dialogue 2 What are the reasons for leaving your last job? They cut my hours. I wanted to work full time, but they only wanted part time workers. Dialogue 3 Why are you looking for another job? There is no growth potential at my current job. I would like to work for a company that has more room to grow. Dialogue 4 Could you tell me why you've decided to leave your current job? Well, there are problems inside the company. Some of the managers do not agree with the company policies. Can you be more specific? Yes. The company does not want to allow foreign investment and management, but some of us disagree. Dialogue 5 
Why did you resign from your previous position? My company was opening branches in other parts of the country. My boss told me I had to transfer. I couldn't move, so I had to resign. Why are you looking for another job? There is no growth potential at my current job. I would like to work for a company that has more room to grow. Why did you leave your previous job? My company was downsizing because of the economy, so I was laid off. Unit 10, Handling Pressure. Dialogue 1. How do you handle pressure? I work very well with pressure. I prepare for it before it comes. Can you give me an example? When I worked at Citibank, we had many deadlines to meet. I never waited until the last minute to do my work. I always finished it ahead of time. How do you deal with the public? I try to treat my customers with respect and patience. Dialogue 2 How do you handle stressful situations? Well, I try to stay as calm as possible. When I'm with a customer, I like to be respectful and responsible. Can you give me an example from your personal experience? An example. Yes, when I was working with Universal Systems as a secretary, a customer came in and he was very angry about his bill. So I spoke calmly and told him to relax. Once he calmed down, we talked about the problem and solved it. He walked away happy and so was I. Dialogue 3 How do you deal with stressful situations at work? Hmm. I've had many stressful situations at work. I always try to stay patient. Whenever I'm feeling stressed, I breathe deeply to calm down. Is there anything else that you do? I try to talk to people to tell them how I feel. If I'm having a problem with a customer, I try to talk politely. If I have some other kind of stress at work, I talk to my co-workers or my boss to tell them how I feel. That usually helps. Dialogue 4 How do you work under pressure? Oh, well, I'm pretty good with pressure. Can you give me an example? Yes. As an accountant, I have to meet monthly deadlines. This can make my work very stressful. I've learned that working hard and staying calm always allows me to meet these deadlines. Dialogue 5 How do you handle stressful situations? I handle them professionally and patiently. I have had experience with stressful situations at work. I always try to prepare myself before the stressful situations happen. Then if they happen, I can handle them without any trouble. Can you give me an example? Sure. If there are two phones ringing, and a customer waiting to be helped. I ask the customer if they can wait for a minute. Then I answer the phones and put them on hold. Next, I try to help the customer quickly and politely. Lastly, I'll take the phone calls.
How do you handle pressure? I work very well with pressure. I prepare for it before it comes. How do you handle stressful situations? I try to stay as calm as possible. When I'm with a customer, I like to be respectful and responsible. How do you deal with stressful situations at work? Hmm. I've had many stressful situations at work. I always try to stay patient. Whenever I'm feeling stressed, I breathe deeply to calm down.